Back to the floor now. This is interesting. Maggie Nichols, we weren't sure if she was going to go on floor exercise or whether it was going to be A.J. Jackson. But Maggie's going, and my goodness, does she have an all-around score going. 995 was the score for Webb. Uh oh. Oh, she's out Darn. of bounds. Again, that's one of those things. I need to do something a little bit harder. And, you know, in practice, it's easy to say, just hold back, do your double tuck. But you get that adrenaline in competition, you know. It made you think, oh, I love that. I love that step out. And Nichols is one of those athletes. They're resting because she had those micro fracture surgeries on her knee on the off season just to give her knee a chance to heal a little bit more. So, like you're right not necessarily doing the most difficult opening tumbling pass, but she doesn't need it right now. But you know, I bet next weekend, because they're gonna be on podium, you're gonna see a different um, skill set being performed by the team. I, that's just my guess, but um, I certainly would want to as an athlete because you have that extra um, lift and you want the experience on podium. Podium, of course, is a three-foot riser like a staging system that they use at the Worlds and the Olympics, and that's how they'll compete at the national championship. So a lot of these gymnasts are eager to try to get on a podium at some time during the regular season because that's how the big meet of the year will be decided on that kind of surface. All right. Great <laughs> routine. <laughs> Salute to the crowd. All right, she's the fifth of six Sooners. A.J. Jackson will wrap it up for OU on the floor exercise. Just a little overcooked this easy tumbling run for her. Well, you can see why she's also number four in the country on floor exercise. Her lowest ranking, I might add, is 